Hello, this is Eric. I'm doing a really short video here to uh, show you how to get the entire gang achievement. Now, last night, um, the video number 11 for this entire playlist, or whatever you want to call this, this series of videos, we got to hell and finished it. And this uh, account that I'm on right now has um, unlocked all the hidden characters. So we'll go back and do those with the other account that I'm playing through. But I just wanted to show you how to get this achievement, or the last part of it. Um, what I want to do first is show you the leaderboards for my account. Um, weekly scores. Uh, that was my run. I finished fifth. Well, the week just started, so there'll probably be other people that get up here. Fastest time, not very good. And then weekly time, not very good either. So... Anyway, that was all from yesterday. But um, what I want to do now is I want to show you this achievement that I'm trying to get. Which is this one right here. The entire gang rescue all eight hidden characters. So that's the one I'm trying to get right now. Uh, as you can see, the achievements take forever to load. It's really, really slow on Xbox. Could have something to do with my internet connection. It probably has something to do actually with how many um, games I've played and how big my profile is on my hard drive. So, anyway, that's all of them. I'll just go through each one and show you what I have. That was the tutorial. And then I got the Kapala very early on uh, in the first stage. Uh, what I r originally did when I first started playing this game was doing co op. So, anyway, um, finished the jungle, the ice cave, the temple, and I got half the journal. Then I got the Ankh and rescued 10 or more damsels. That was a really tricky achievement. Um, it's probably a lot more difficult than most people would imagine. It requires a lot of luck and it requires some, you know, pretty good skill. You need to run where you get enough bombs that you can get damsels out and the damsels aren't stuck up in the ceiling when you don't have pace. You know, it just requires a lot of different things. Um, you can't have a level where, for example, uh, the TNT crates spawn in front of the damsel, that happens a lot of times, and if that does, then you just can't get them out easily, or at all. So anyway, that was a tricky achievement. This one's for uh, finishing the game, and then killing all the shopkeepers. I actually finished the game by doing the shortcuts, I just did the temple over and over and over until I got used to it. Uh, the shopkeepers, that's so easy to do, because if you're going to have any sort of substantial run, you need to kill all the shopkeepers in the black market. and that point forward and the interesting thing about killing 12 of them you don't actually have to kill them they just have to die so they could die on their own fall on the spikes in the ice caves they can fall into the abyss whoops sorry about that now we have to wa wait for all the pitchers to spawn again well we're just going to start from over here uh reach the city of gold complete the game without using shortcuts and then do it um with co-op that was a kind of tricky achievement Basically what I did was I started throughout like the beginning part of the game and um, sacrificed my second character as many times as I could. So I did it, I think, like twice, and then I kept it dead for the rest of the game until I got to the temple. And then uh, either 5-2 or 5-3, I um, took the second character out of a um, casket, which you're going to see here in a second. That's where the next uh, hidden character is that I need to get. So you basically whip them out of the casket, and then they are free to play again. So what I did was I whipped him out on um, like 4-2 and then I just beat Olmec with that character. And then I quickly ran the exit and that was it. And these three that we got last night, finishing the journal, completing the game the hard way, and over 500,000. So, alright, anyway, what I did this for is I want to show you how to get the last hidden character. This character is really tricky, it was all the way down here. So. There we go, that's the last one, that should be an achievement. And there it is. So. Hooray! Let's do a little celebration dance here. Oh, careful, you're gonna get killed. She doesn't want to get picked up again. I don't blame her. I wouldn't want to get picked up by this guy, he's kind of creepy looking. Well, we'll just run through here quick, see if we can get the exit. I don't think I can, because I have to use all my bombs to actually get out. Um, I don't even know where the exit is. This level is pretty tricky. This is always my concern when you do the temple. You end up with a level like this, what the heck are you supposed to do? I mean, we've got 
Anubis down there. We've got all that crap coming up. Bubbles and whatnot. What I'm going to do is just chicken out. <laughs> I'm not even going to bother. So that's cool. We got all the characters. Um, what I'll do here. I'll just show the achievement tile. So you have the picture. You get to see it. There it is, a little casket and all the characters. So uh, we still have to do a couple more, finish the game in under eight minutes, uh, play Venture Mode a thousand times. I'm only at like just under 700,000, I think. Uh, 700, not 700,000. I think I have 677. And uh, complete the game without collecting any treasure. That one's going to be a nightmare. So that is it for now. Um, thank you for watching this short video, and have a great day.